Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Füchse TV. Heute wieder mal mit einem Kabinengespräch und neben mir der Spieler des Monats Februar. Hallo Wille. Hallo, hallo. How are you? I'm good, thank you. So, das war die Frage auf Englisch, den Rest machen wir jetzt in Deutsch. Ähm, Wille, du wurdest zum Spieler des Monats Februar ausgezeichnet und diese besondere Anerkennung zum Ende der Hauptrunde durch die Fans, ist das ein gutes Gefühl für dich? Ja, yeah, of course, like, it feels, feels good, to, good to have that thing and like that uh, and there is some people who, who thought that I, I did some good things on the ice and ja. Yeah. That's, that's really nice from them. Okay. Wenn ich dich mit einem Motor vergleichen möchte, brauchtest du dieses Jahr etwas länger zum Warmwerden und dann auf die ähm, erforderliche Drehzahl wie gewohnt zu kommen und zu arbeiten? In den letzten Spielen ähm, scortest du ja schon in altbekannten Dimensionen. Ja, yeah, I mean, I've been believing it the, the whole season, but uh, sometimes. Hockey is like that, that, you know, like not always like things are going to, to your way, how you want them to go. And uh, but uh, then you just have to keep working hard and uh, believing yourself. And uh, and yeah, I, I that's what I did. And uh, the whole whole season, I, I was believing myself that at some point it will turn the better way. And uh, Yeah, lately it's been it's been good and when it's good then you just have to keep doing the same things that you you work hard and you you do the same things what what gives you the best chance to be successful. Wille, wie schätzt du die aktuelle Hauptrunde der Saison denn persönlich ein diese extrem enge Tabellenkonstellation von Anfang bis Ende war das für dich persönlich eher zusätzlich Stress oder Motivator? I think it it gives you a motivation. Like I I don't see it that it's the it's the stress uh, stress and all. Cause like yeah, I just think like every game is like even more important. Of course, there is all, always just uh, three points available. But uh, but yeah, the situation in standings it's 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 been really tight the whole season pretty much. So then every game really like matters and. Ja, yeah, it's, it's been good motivation. Dankeschön. Ähm, bis zum Jahresende punktete ja das Team regelmäßig. Danach war dann fast vier Wochen so ein bisschen der Wurm drin. Was macht das mit einem bis dahin funktionierenden Team? Um, I think like most of the times every, every team has some ups and ups and downs inside the season and uh, uh, I think it was Probably like at the end of the end of the day, it was good to have those downs in a little bit before, and then you know, like then we find find the way back in the jack, and then hopefully we are the we are able to play our best game like right now when when it actually matters the most. So yeah, so, you know, like especially when you, when when you have those downs, then then it's a good good uh, opportunity for a team to build together even more and makes it makes it like a stronger 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 group. Wille, schauen wir ein bisschen auf deine Vergangenheit. Ähm, in Bayreuth warst du letzte Saison noch Kapitän und am Ende Topscorer im Team. Ist ähm, so eine Statistik ähm, für dich jetzt eine zusätzliche Belastung, wenn man in ein anderes Team wechselt? Yeah, I, I don't see that uh I don't see that has anything to do with uh, with this season. Like, yeah, you just go to a new team and it's a new new teammates, new new uh, new locker room, new coaches. So, yeah, I don't I don't see that as a as a pressure or anything. So, yeah, I don't think it has anything to do with it. Wille, du hast vier Jahre in Bayreuth gespielt. Beobachtest du das Team dort noch so ein bisschen? No, not that much. Like. I'm I'm following a little bit Oberliga too. I have some friends playing playing in there so of course like when you when you follow the the game results then of course you see all the teams there and and yeah but uh, they basically changed the whole team so so I don't I don't have like friends in that team 
I I don't think they have. Maybe they have a couple of players actually in that team, but still from last year. But uh, but no, I'm I'm not really following Bayreuth that much. Thank you. Now you're in Sachse. In this year, we had a complete äh, Sächsische Derby Wochenende. Ähm, These hot Sächsischen Duelle, gleich hintereinander. Ähm, Kommt dieser Ehrgeiz unter den Kontrahenten bei dir als Spieler automatisch oder erst im Laufe der Saison? Ja, yeah, like der Derby Games are all, always like fun to play and uh, I think like the a little extra extra motivation is coming like automatically for those games. But like I said earlier, like every game this season is been like really important games. So like of course you you want to make your yourself ready for those games too and basically like it doesn't matter if it's a derby game or on against someone else like you have to prepare yourself the same way but um, of course like the atmosphere atmosphere with the fans and everything then it's a little better with with derbies okay um, das ist jetzt alles durch. Ähm, schauen wir auf das kommende Programm. Der Druck äh, des Klassenerhaltes ist ja weg. Ihr könnt alle äh, frei aufspielen. Äh, mit welchen Emotionen gehst du persönlich in die äh, Pre-Playoffs? Um, ja, I mean, it's it's the best time of the year and it's like everybody wants to play these games. So it gives you a, for sure, it gives you a little extra motivation and And uh, yeah, these are the best games. So I'm sure like everyone feels the same way that it's pretty nice to get to play these games. Mm -hmm. um, die Pre-Playoffs starten und habt ihr im Team ab morgen dann auch neue Rituale, um euch dort jetzt gegenseitig zu pushen? No, I, I don't. I don't think there is any any new new rituals. Like I, I uh, yeah, I think everyone is doing the their own thing. Like how they're used to do it and and yeah that's it. Vielen vielen Dank Wille. Dann hoffen wir und drücken wir die Daumen, dass es für die Lausitzer Füchse für unser Team noch ganz ganz weit in den kommenden Spielen geht. Wille, vielen Dank für das Gespräch und damit verabschieden wir uns jetzt bei euch bei Füchse TV und freuen uns natürlich, wenn er demnächst wieder einschaltet. Dankeschön Wille. Thank you.